And now it's time for Spring Fever with the Twins with Neil Roberts from Fort Myers, Florida. When you're down in Florida covering the Twins in spring training, you never know who you'll run into. Lots of celebrities from past players to other media people, including Jonathan Mayo, the MLB Network. And Jonathan, thanks for taking some time with us. Really appreciate it. From a coverage standpoint, is this your favorite time of year? Is it more toward the draft or is it the playoffs? Or does it all get you excited? I like it all. I mean, they each bring different challenges. You know, the draft can be a grind. And the Arizona Fall League is probably when I enjoy just being out at the field the most. The access is tremendous because there's nobody around. The competition is really good. And it's one of the few times you get when you're not able to go on the road and see players during the season to see good players in action on the field multiple days. All right. Hey, we'll talk the Twins minor league system when we come back. In a retirement community, you want to spend time enjoying the amenities, not paying for hidden costs. At Somerset Court, our fees cover everything. We're all inclusive. Medication assistance, restaurant style dining, valet parking, shuttle service, it's all included. There's no extra charge. With a retro style movie theater, 24 hour ice cream bar, auditorium for hosting events and more, Somerset Court is resort style living at its finest. Apartments are available now. Somerset Court, give us a call at 701-838-4500 or online at Somerset setcourt.net. Hey, this is Krista Saba of Tiger Lily. As a band, we spend a lot of our lives on the road. But last December, my life could have ended on the road. I was involved in a crash that left me upside down in a ditch. But I was safely held in wearing my seatbelt, the thing that saved my life. I always buckle up, even for short trips. And that's why I'm here today. Seatbelts do save lives. Buckle up every trip, every time, and stay on the road of life. A safety message from the North Dakota Department of Transportation. With MLB Network's Jonathan Mayo and Jonathan, is there a guy under the radar, you think, in the organization that you want to check out down here? I guess it depends on your definition of under the radar. <laughs> you know, I mean, there's so much more coverage of prospects than there used to be. You know, is a guy like Lewin Diaz under the radar? From a national perspective, he probably is. I'm very excited to see what he could do over the course of a full season. Jonathan, last question, gut reaction. Who do you think the Twins select in the draft this summer? It's way early to, to know for sure. I would I would love for it to be Hunter Green, just because a high school right-hander has never been taken number one overall. I'd like for someone to break that, that streak. And then Jaron Kendall from Vanderbilt is probably the one position player from the college ranks to, to keep an eye on. But Hunter Green is the top talent in the draft class. The high school right-handers, you know, that there's always some nervousness about taking them that high. All right. Hey, Jonathan, thanks for your time and enjoy the rest of the spring training and regular season. Thanks for having me. All right, Jonathan Mayo with us again. Hey, that concludes this edition. Until next time, I'm Neil Roberts. You've been listening to Spring Fever Baseball, brought to you in part by Somerset Court, living life to the fullest, and by the North Dakota Department of Transportation.